make my rosé in a classic old world style. That means that I pick the grapes when they're very cold, early in the morning. I take them into the winery and rather than crush them, I take them whole, all still intact, put them right into the press where we squeeze them very gently. The, these are black grapes, remember. They're the same grapes that I make the Mathis Grenache, the red wine from. We squeeze them very gently and just the palest pink juice comes out of them. And uh, I taste that juice constantly. I'm looking for a little bit of tannin. Uh, and when I taste that tannin, that's the end. I don't, I don't want any of that in the, the juice that I make the wine from. I'm also looking for the color. I want to make sure it doesn't get too dark. So the harder you squeeze it, you can imagine it gets darker and darker. So this is just from the first half of the pressing. I take that juice and then ferment it. The result is a beautiful, aromatic, very pale, you can see the color, uh, it's a gorgeous, beautiful wine, um, delicate in its aroma, it still retains all its fruitiness because of the cool fermentation, and it has a great balance, a great soft texture in the mouth, it's incredibly refreshing, it's very zesty too, it still has a lot of bright acidity from the balanced by the soft, sweet flavors of the kind of strawberry and raspberry fruit characters. It's just beautiful. It's so refreshing. I'm going to drink some.